Hey everybody, today I'm going to do one of my all-time favorite things, and that is open a spooky box. Now, for those of you who don't know what Spooky Box Club is, it's basically a box that you can get a subscription to every month, or you can buy one box at a time, whatever you want, uh, and it has a different, a different theme every single month. But the kind of majority of the, the theme, like the basic like theme of the themes, is uh, like Halloween and spooky and... You know, so it's great for those of us who are obsessed with Halloween, but then once October's over, like now, we are kind of going into withdrawals and we need more spookiness in our life. So that's why the Spooky Box Hub is my favorite box ever. So I'm going to attempt to open this box. Ooh, it's got a skull on it. Look at the skull sticker. I'm actually really excited. Dude, it's like, not, like I think I've said this before, but like nothing's better than when I like go to my P.O. box. And because this will never fit in my actual P.O. box, they always put in like a little slip uh, to let me know I have a package. And sometimes it's a spooky box, sometimes it's other things. But man, when I give them that slip and then they come from the back and they're carrying this purple box, it's like, all right, I guess I'm doing a video today because I gotta know what's in it now. Oh, there's little heart confettis. There's always like the cutest little confetti things ever. And here's the inside of the box. Whoop. Uh, as I, everything flies out of it, so they always put it in an adorable thank you card. Oh, it's so cute, the little, oh, look at the ghost and the little sucker. It's so freaking cute. Oh. So, we have, for this th month's theme, uh, is the Victorian Boudoir Box. And the best thing about Spooky Box is that they always donate a portion to a cause. So, for this month, we raise money for the National Trust. And it looks like, whoa, we've got a DIY Raven Potpourri Satchet. Is that the right word? Satchet. We have provided, we have provided with you a reusable potpourri sachet. Is it sachet or sachet? Or sachet? Sachet. That you can stuff with your desired filling. Ooh. You can use your potpourri sachet in many different ways, depending upon the filling. Keep it in your laundry drawer for a wonderful scent. Hang it over your bed uh, to relax you and induce a better night's sleep. Hang it on your wardrobe to war off, ward off moths. Uh, place the sachet with your clothes if you have a seasonal wardrobe. Store it in with your linens to keep them fresh. Loop the sachet set, set shit, <laughs> whoops, <laughs> over a coat hanger, keep it by your side, so there's like, oh, this is really cool. Uh, these will remain fragrant for a very long time and only need a gentle squeeze to revive them. Okay, let's see. Ooh, 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 this is, ooh, this is, ooh, this must, ooh, this, oh, look at, Raven Popery Satch, Satch, shit, Satch it, I keep saying other words. This is freaking cute. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is adorable. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. You unzip it from back here and you put your thingies in there. Oh my gosh. This is actually really cute. This is super cute. Look, look. It's just, it's a raven. That is super cute. Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Is this a little pillowcase? Look. Oh my gosh. Is this a little pillowcase? Did you throw this in there? Yeah, it's a rest in peace cushion. You guys see the whole thing? It's got little bats. It's so cute. Oh my gosh. Now I need to find a little pillow. Or I could just probably fill it with whatever, right? It'll just be a cushion. You won't be able to see what's inside of it. Alright. Ornate looking glass assortment. Um, this looks pretty amazing. Um, oh! Confetti is falling everywhere. Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> All of the oohs. Oh my gosh, you guys! You guys! Mirror number one. Ooh. 
Mirror number two. <gasps> Dude. Mirror number three. Oh my gosh. Look at these. Oh my gosh. I'm assuming that there is like, oh there is, okay. Let's see if I can do this. Oh my gosh, come on, why? Oh my gosh, they're little mirrors. Do you see yourself in the camera? Look at that, look at that. It'd be cool to like hang them all like stacky, you know, like this, like all like, dude, these are amazing. And we have the Gothic note cards. Oh dude, this, this is cool. It's like Ouija board, but not, but kind of. Make your presence known. Is there anybody there? That's really cool. What's this one? Memento Mori. Oh, they have little coffins. Look at the little coffins. Oh, the little coffins are so cute. Oh, I'm getting hearts everywhere. Those are super cute. Heirloom cobweb. I can't speak. Uh, heirloom cobweb lace doilies. Oh my gosh. Let's look at, let's look at them. These are like way better than like regular doilies, but uh, dude, they have like the little pentagram thing on them. Look at these. They're light and dark at the same time. Oh my gosh. Those are cute. You can use them as like little coasters or put your coasters on them. Or, ooh, this one doesn't have the thingy, the, the, the star, but also oh, one of them does. Oh, that's cool that they're, that two are different. Wait, they're all different. Whoa! <laughs> so this one's just like a circle. And this one has the star. And then this one is just like, kind of like that. Ooh, what is this? Ooh, ooh. Ooh, a gothic lace and vinyl makeup bag. Oh my gosh, you guys, I needed a makeup bag that's smaller than the one that I have. And this is lacy. It's all lace. Dude, this is cute, look. So oh, cool. Dude, this is super cool. This is the coolest thing ever. If I can get it to like open. Oh, it's actually quite large. That's what she said. Um, this is super cool. I needed a makeup bag, like bad. I have like a giant one, but that's what I keep my makeup in. But if I'm like traveling somewhere, dude, you can put anything in this. You can put like shampoo, you can put hairspray, you can do whatever. That is so cool. And it's lace. Like, do you know how hard it is to find a cute makeup bag, like a cute one that matches like your style? It's really hard. It's really hard. <laughs> <gasps> this is really cool. This is. Ouija pendant on a chain. Oh dude, and it comes with the, it's like a mini Ouija board. It's like I got a mini Ouija board, and then I got the little planchette. Let's see if I can, whoa. Dude, I would have never thought I would have one of these. And I've expressed to you guys, like, my feelings towards Ouija board stuff, but this is just like memorabilia stuff, so I don't think it's like, evil or nothing, but look, you can have like a mini Ouija, can I, can I summon some tiny ghosts? Tiny ghosts? No. <laughs> and, ooh, dude, skull hair ties. These, okay, these are like cool hair ties. Look at these. Dude, so cool. Can I open you? Thanks. Dude, look at these. Man, you'd be like, your hair would be styling. Skulls. And you get two of them. So cool. And last, but not least, as usual, a lollipop. And this one is Raspberry Ripple Lollipop. Dude, and seriously, these are always like super, super, super good. They always taste really, really good. Oh, wow. 
So that is it for this spooky box. Uh, comment down below, let me know which item was your favorite. And uh, if you would like your very own spooky box, you can check them out at spookyboxclub.com. They also have Instagram, and I believe a Twitter and a Tumblr, are both spooky box club. So you can check them out, follow them. Uh, if you go on their website, they'll have like prices and stuff on how much things are. You can buy some things individually, sometimes. Sometimes you can just buy one box in particular. And I believe it's $32 a month uh, if you would like to get your own box. So check them out. They're awesome. One man team, Sarah. She's awesome and super nice and talented at picking the items that go in this box, creating the boxes, creating the pack. I mean, she does it all by herself. So it's worth it. Uh, so follow her and her spooky box on all those things. I'll have all the links down below. Um, I love you guys and I'll talk to you later.